This new product from Nomad has easily been my favorite iPhone accessory because it brings me back to the iPhone 4 days when we used to buy those bumper cases. Over the last couple months, for whatever reason, I no longer like having cases on my phone. I think it has to do with the new curved edges on the iPhone as well as the S24 Ultra. So I was really excited to see this new product from Nomad called the Magnetic Leather Back, and it's essentially a case without being a case. I've actually been fortunate enough to already have a magnetic leather back on my 15 Pro Max. So this is what it looks like in the rustic brown. I've been using it for about a week. It does get a little bit of wear and tear, but I find when it comes to leather cases, it just makes it look better in general. So taking a look at the case itself, you can tell that it doesn't really add much in terms of bulk. You get to keep that general shape of the iPhone that we now love to hold on to with those new rounded edges. But at the same time, it does offer some protection to the back glass of the phone. Still have that raised cutout for your lenses in case you were to drop the phone to offer at least that little bit of protection. But like I said, at the end of the day, the rails on the edge of your phone are unprotected. So you still wanna be careful when using this case. So I'm fortunate enough to have a second case here in black for my iPhone 15 Pro. If we turn it over, it says it's vegetable tan leather from the USA, attaches with MagSafe and micro suction, and it's MagSafe and wireless charging compatible. So let's go ahead and get the box open. very minimal packaging. And so here it is in the black leather. You can see that MagSafe ring in the center and then the three micro suction zones that are gonna help it keep in place. And again, because of that MagSafe, it really doesn't take much in order to get this in place. You're just gonna place it right on top of your phone. It clicks into place. I give it a little press on the edges to make sure that everything stays where it's supposed to. And then just like that, you've got it installed. And so I just like how minimal these cases are. It really doesn't add much to the phone at all. And that bit of leather on the back does add some extra grippiness so that you're not gonna drop it when you're holding your phone. So this is the white iPhone 15 Pro and I really like how the black accents those silver rails on the edge. I just think it looks really crispy, but also very professional as well. And again, a close up of the rustic brown on the blue iPhone 15 Pro Max still looks pretty good. I don't think you can go wrong with either of these colors, but my personal preference is definitely the brown. And the reason being is that anyone who's ever owned a leather product knows that over time, it gets that nice rugged look to it. And in my personal opinion, the textures just look better on brown leather than they do on the black. One thing that I mentioned earlier is that it does maintain the MagSafe compatibility on the back. So they've got MagSafe on the inside and an outer layer of MagSafe as well. That way you are able to use all of your MagSafe accessories. So you don't have to worry about now not being able to use the charger that you bought or if you have a magnetic car stand, for example, as I do. So if you've never used a MagSafe product from Nomad in the past, you can rest assured that these magnets are fantastic. So if you're curious how much these cases might run you, they are $40 USD or $61 Canadian directly from the Nomad website. As far as I know, there's nowhere else that you can buy them. So you can't really pick these up on Amazon or anything like that. And at that price, even though it doesn't fully involve up your phone, I think that these are definitely worth it because even though it doesn't protect your entire phone, it still protects the back glass as well as the lenses. And at the same time, it makes your phone look pretty sleek and unique. If you've got any questions or concerns about the magnetic leather back from Nomad, feel free to drop your comments down below. But that's pretty much it for me. Much love as always, throwing up two of them, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.